and welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Gold Crest Valley 19. Woohoo! Your host with not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, today, well, I, I bought a few toys out of the money. What was it? It was around $407,000 or something from the sawmill and selling the combine. Well, we bought a combine and just the grain hair for it. The J&M cart here, um, a tether and a weeder, and a flatbed trailer, and some construction work on the uh, ground over there cost, which brought us to, y'all ready for this now? Y'all ready? Uh oh, now pipe out, same button on the keyboard. Um, yeah, I'm down to 92,827. Um, reason why I bought the J&M cart, well, first of all, how y'all doing? Y'all doing all right? I hope y'all are. Y'all are an amazing family, you know that? Can't thank y'all enough. All right, the J&M cart, I bought it. We're going to fill it up with wheat. And that's going to be what we feed our chickens with. When that bag gets empty, we're just going to feed out of that JLM cart. And hopefully it'll last till you know, next year. Which we're going to be planting some wheat. I just, uh, let's, let's make sure the road's clear before we, well, I ain't got my lights on. There we go, turn the hazards on. Uh, we got the combines already out here. We got it tested. Everything's good. Got a full uh, hopper. So that's what we got to do first is go empty it and get started. I, I, I need a bunch of stuff done and I just don't know really where to start. We need to mow around field 11. I guess we have to put the tree crew off for a little bit. So we do some farming. But wherever we get out of this field is ours to sell, keep, or whatever it's for doing the uh, help and put in the sawmill up there. So having to say that, now of course, you know, all reality of role play, we had to buy this field in order to do the sawmill or even cut the trees up there. Please tell me you want to work in this. You worked last time. Oh lordy. Let's shut this guy off. Save fuel. And while I'm flying. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. So uh, I wasn't thinking. I put the sawmill up there. You know, I, I thought I was putting it on our ground here. Let me show you real quick. Probably going all this. Oh, by the way, I'm glad that popped up. Uh, I got one, two, three, four contracts done, done two plowing. Ain't much, but, you know, we went ahead and done it. Uh, cultivating was two. Uh, I used the same tractor to do both of these, so that saved some. Uh, there's a John Deere and... I guess I need to show y'all that. Let's, let's go ahead and set these to collect. Well, yeah. I think y'all y'all seen it in a couple of episodes ago, so that'd be alright, right? Just go back and watch them. Alright. So they won't want nothing disappearing. Uh what we got here? Ooh. Now that's that's a nice setup. Field thirty one. We could use our combine and uh, make some money off of that, and we'll we'll probably do that. And let's see, we're gonna go ahead and tell them we're gonna do it, and we'll do it after we get this. One. But anyway, as I was saying, I just baby up. 
think I might have to scoot over. It took last time on the phone. Oh, I saw it, I saw it. Oh. Alright, there it goes. Or was. It's just straw mound here, I think. Let's... There it goes. You barely can see it coming out. But it's going down. But anyway, um, so I can't sell this field back. You know, uh, I bought it so we can get the crop off of it and, and role play it as, uh, you know, we're putting a sawmill in for the price of the stuff, plus cutting the trees and stuff. But since I got the sawmill in, uh, I can't sell it because, uh, hey, you got a place bowl here. You can't sell this right now. Sell the place bowl, then you can sell the ground. So. I could just keep it and and like we're leasing it. All right, we're done here. And I, I want to show you this. I have to get out to show you this, but this new thing I got in, Control G, and it pulls up your global company. Now if you go to uh, here, there's a new leasing thing. Well, this is sold. Um, well, if I can hit sell, please don't let it delete the stuff. Okay, now I'm on leases. Wait, first I want to see. Field 11 is not ours no more. Okay. Prove that. Just, start the header up. It shouldn't let us cut. Okay. It shouldn't be letting us cut this. Okay. I don't know what's wrong with there, but it's going on out. Oh man, it's field five. <laughs> Oops. Control G. Let's go to field five. We need to buy the field 11. Well, we'll lease it instead of buying it since we can do this now. Field five. Sell. Okay, we're going to sell. Let's try this now it shouldn't let us cut we do not have access to this land okay that will work now we, we, we're gonna launch my drone uh jay we're gonna fly to this the sawmill <laughs> let's just hope it's still there Please still be there, because if not, all that stuff I've done. Hey, look, it's still there. It's still there. I like it, folks. I like it. Whoa. Oh, yeah, that's right. This was seven hundred and something thousand dollars. That okay. Yeah, they're still there. That's there. The signs there. The storage areas there. And let's drop down. And let's be unrealistic for a second here. I want to see. Whatever I thought. Got a little bit slow. There's a. Uh, See if we can sell this real quick. The sawmill still works. We'll just lease it and uh, try to get all up in there. There we go. I won't make a money from it. Making money. Making money.
So far, so good. 2,454 off up, folks. And oh, it would be saving. What I'm going to do, let's go see if it's showing a green. No, no green symbol. All right, that's good. That's good. That's what I wanted. Now to be all uh, fair about it, I'm going to turn around and lease this so we can get the crop off of it and uh, everything be back fair. All right, and J. And then we're going to go back to the global company, which is G. Field 5. We're going to lease it. Field 5 for 18,471. Lease tag. I don't know what that means. But we're leasing it. So. And you can see it says leased. Alright. So we get, I have to pay $1,847 each day for it. We should have this done in no time, hopefully. Let's see if we can get back in our combine and start harvesting. Alright, we're back to it. Alright, I'm gonna hire. Um, who, who can we hire? Somebody. How about. Hmm, I'll insert a tag right here. I, I can't think of anybody right now. My mind's blank. I just say, uh. Robin. He's one of my YouTubers. Which I have a bunch. But it's usually the same ones uh, call off every day, so yeah. Uh, I don't know. Let's, I'm going to stop that right here. It's actually the truck to back down on that. And let's walk on back over to the shop here. Um, we are going to show you something well not necessary to the shop but then uh, yesterday or correction the last video of this and which should be yesterday if I get to upload this on time this is a different shed and I also screwed it back some the post was right in here somewhere when you see other posts way down there so I did scoot it back some and as you can see uh, ready to outsource is uh, 148,000 17% hey and if you walk on over here it should change and I guess it's not Uh, straw is eight hundred and sixty-eight thousand. Nice capacity. It's fifty-six thousand liters of straw. It'll help if I could read, and one hundred forty-eight thousand of hay. But this is supposed to work. It's the newest one from the global company. So, yeah. My other plan is we're going to have to talk to the guy that owns this side. I think we can cut a few trees here sure in mine. We're going to smooth some of this out so we can put um, silage bales storage right here. And our big cow pasture will be right over there. Can we beat the train? I don't know if we can beat the train. Let's beat the train. Mm, trains pretty fast. Wish I could run like this in real life. All right. 
You haven't seen this. The J &M 680 grain cart. And we need to get something to pull it over there. And, and here's our flatbed. This is a new one. I can't remember the modder. It's branded lizard. It's kind of like the other one, but it's, this one's got the trailer hitch on the back. I can't remember if it did it or not. Got balloon tires on here. So, yeah. Let me go in the store real quick. I remember where it's at. I don't know where it was at. Here? Yeah. Um, but that's it. Beta test two. I don't know if it's by the same guy or not, but it's uh, yeah, I can't hardly see that. So, yeah, there you go. <laughs> All right, um, we're gonna get our truck. Ah, if I don't run into the wall, I'm gonna drop this here. Get the gravity wagon, go over to the uh, combine, and I'll meet y'all over. Be right back. All right, we caught him before he got full. Well, almost. Sounds about right. Story of my life, right? Do a screenshot real fast. Let's pipe back in. Mm, about right there. I always forget to take them, and it's always too late. Alright folks, I'm going to get a little bit more of this done and I will bring y'all back uh, I guess when we get the truck full and get it to the elevator with the highest price So, be back in a little while A couple seconds for y'all Alright everybody, we are down here at Mary's Farm As you can see here, we're going to sell it for 1056 bushel, I believe Now it's wheat Mary's Farm Gonna hit my roll my cover back here. Turn that thing's fast. Alright, let's go on up here and see if we can line up on this. Um, this ramp here. I don't know why they had to I dug it out and put it in the ground a little bit. So my hopper bottoms might drag. Ooh, it came close. My front wheel is off the ground. Alright, let's stop right there. I'm on. Uh, what am I on? Should be on. Yeah, I'm on the front. Switch to the back. Oh, I don't want to do that. Now that I switch to the back. Oh yeah, these trailers won't let me do but one at a time. Well, folks, uh, I, this is going to be it for this episode as soon as we sell this. I um, got the combine full, I got the grain cart full, and the truck was full. So that was 16738 plus what a little bit I missed. I guess the back ones. Alright. Oh, it's okay. I was probably doing it all wrong. Alright, let's see what we get for this. And I'll be right back. Alright, sorry about the interruption, y'all. Um, but yeah, our grain, or chaser bin, auger wagon, whatever you want to call it, it's full. Combine's full. And that's going to bring us 17,978. 
in which we're at 1,105,545. Go ahead and get off their scales here. Or, not scales, but a little thing there. Uh, we're going to go on my tablet and go ahead and electronic pay off some of the, the bank loan. Not all of it, but some of it. Uh, we're at 700,000, so let's, uh, we're pay some of that, all right? Uh, I'm so close, so I'm going to go ahead and pay this off. That'd be one long we don't have to worry about, folks. But we're fixing to get more money in, uh, because, uh, let's see. Okay, loans paid off on that from the bank. $405,545 left there. Let's go on over here. And we're just a little over halfway. And that was $120,000 plus. Let's see if we can go in here. I'm going to enter. Um, so $120,000 plus. Uh, 20 be 40 so that's 145,000 there and we'll go and go in the combine plus uh, 10,000 so 145 be 155,000 this off this much right here and plus yeah I've been making them bells I hooked the uh, we'll show you I shouldn't have said this be all up let's show you this real quick been doing this in between the combine loads but we got the case international 1455 xl since it's got the duels so close together i figured this would be perfect uh horsepower matches i think it's 140 horsepower and that's 145 so yeah we got five more horses to do what we need to do with so uh next episode we'll finish thrashing harvesting whatever you want to call it and We'll uh, get some bales. I'll, I'll probably just going to catch. I'm going to work probably. Let's see, it's almost 8 o'clock now. It's 7.39. So I'm going to probably work till dark. Maybe. I might finish this field. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, when we come back, we'll be... Uh, Finishing up what I don't get, bailing, picking up the bales, and, and mowing. We got all kind of stuff. So just come on back next episode and make sure you have some tea or popcorn or something so you can sit back and relax. And uh, yeah, but I appreciate all your love and support, folks. Your, your, your comments are awesome. Y'all are awesome. Y'all are just awesome. I can't thank y'all enough. So a big fat hug and a big fat thank you. Y'all have a great day, a blessed day. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.